afternoon. This is Don Hadley doing another drive through but doing it in my library. There's a model that we use with clients sometimes to kind of think through strategically over the next three years where they're trying to take their organization. So one of the first pieces is that is really about vision. And the reason vision is so important, if we simply use a one-year business plan, it's not far enough out to really see any dramatic change. In fact, what we find in a lot of cases, the first year of trying to do something, you're kind of cleaning up messes. The second year, a lot of times, you're getting the foundation solidified. Third year is when you're really starting to rock and roll and make things happen. And it doesn't mean you have to use those exact time frames, but I find three years seems to be about a minimum to really get people where they can start believing, if you will, and there's enough disconnect between the now and the future that they feel like there's enough time where we can get change. Part of that, though, is there's also got to be a roadmap. Because without a roadmap, you're not going to have confidence in me that we really will get to California. If I'm driving from North Carolina to California, it's about 2,500 miles. Uh, there better be a plan. Now, by the way, it doesn't mean the plan will stay the plan. But what it does do is gives a rough roadmap and a way of measuring are we in lockstep going the right direction. The S part of this, B was first, the second is S, is really structure. What I find is a lot of organizations that have vision or a roadmap don't necessarily have a structure that focuses energy. We need a structure. How often are we going to meet and talk about it? What's the org chart look like? What's the future org chart look like? What's the future uh, positions that are maybe open that people could work their way into if they do a great job? It's very, very important uh, to have that structure piece. A lot of times, companies will stop at that point, though, and feel like we've got a structure. Structure supports the vision where we're going. But what they forget about is the engine. And when I think of the engine, I want you to think back on everything in your life. And was it accomplished by intellect, brains, or was it your engine? Was it inside, the drive, the passion, the energy? Uh, the willingness to keep going through thick and thin, the willingness to go communicate a problem, whether it was in school or business or personal thing, there's a lot of engine needed, the willingness to go at and keep going. In a way, this is the heart piece. And as part of this heart piece, it really is what drives all of this. A lot of this stuff, in fact, we had a company a few years ago in Raleigh that called me and said, hey, come help us. And they presented a great vision roadmap structure but the people just didn't have the engine, the motivation. They kept saying, well, how do we fix it? How do we fix it? I said, you need to get the engine moving and running, and, or you need to get a new engine. And uh, they couldn't understand why what they built was so intellectually wonderful, why it wouldn't go anywhere, and it was because of the engine. And then the last piece is really about the culture. And the reason this culture piece is so important is... The engine has got to come from the leader. It's got to get out into the team of people. It's got to get out in the different divisions, departments, locations. But eventually, it's got to impact the culture so the culture wants to go here. If the culture doesn't want to go there, it ain't going there. And I don't care how smart we are, how much we know, but we've got to have this piece connect to this. And this engine is what really connects the logic, puts the firepower in it, and gets them wanting to do it. So I wanted to share that quick model with you. Because sometimes when I'm talking to people for the first time, I ask them, tell me about your vision roadmap. Tell me about the structure you've created. What's the engine like? What's the passion? What's the drive motivation? And then how are you pulling your culture into this? And how's the culture supporting uh, the vision roadmap? So if you haven't done that, ask yourself, ask your team, ask your culture these questions. Uh, if you want to ask me about it, 919-368-9008. Uh, Don Hadley. Thank you.